uh, that time of day, eh? Yep. Mind me, I'm just making my stupid little YouTube clip. Letting my family and friends know I'm still alive. I'm Sonic Hair. Day 22. In the hospital. No, I'm not going insane. I'm just I'm doing a little video diary thingy. Uh, I'm trying to keep myself sane. I'm not insane, really. I'm just trying. I guess, okay, maybe I am. Um. Anyway, Terry's nurse is here. He's got to take care of some business. Uh, let's see. Alright, Sonic Care, Charles Lanson. Day 22. Alright. Day 22. I wonder if the lighting would be better if I go like this. Actually, do there actually is some stuff to report today's episode. Uh, Wednesday, April sixteenth, twenty fourteen. Yeah, I hate this gown. It's gonna drive me insane. But, uh, I guess people start to report, make a little bit of progress, make some real some light on this situation. Oh, wow, here we go. My, uh, IV alarm is going off, so hopefully you'll, uh, get to meet my, uh, cool nurse, Katie. Maybe not. Who the hell not? Okay. But we shall see. I got 52 notices. Uh, let's see. So, um. I hit the light here. Uh, I don't know if that's better or not, but. F it, man. Okay, so, what is the report? Okay, on the therapy front, big step forward. Can I help you? Uh, yeah, the alarm is going off on my IV. Okay, I'll let the nurse know. Thank you. turn it off soon because that thing will drive me nuts. I hate the IV alarm. Basically means my uh my anti antibiotics are done right now. But hey man, we're just gonna let it keep running. Alright, so uh what to report. Okay, yeah. Therapy wise big huge step forward. They're actually letting me sit on the side of my bed now. Sorry, I didn't mean to wake you yet. For like, I don't know, five minute yeah. periods of time. Mm, sure. Which, I don't know, seems pretty stupid and pointless to me. I did it yesterday and it's like, okay, I'm sitting on the side of my bed, now what? Well, I'll just sit there for five minutes. Okay. Um, so anyway, but that, that, I guess that is an important first step because that shows I now that um, I guess the thing on my ass is actually healing enough to where they're actually letting me sit on it for um, little periods of time. Next big development. Um, you know, so just the other day I was telling one of them well, shit, I can't wait until, man, yeah, yeah, I can't wait till I can just even just get back in my chair again. I mean, just take a stroll around the hallway. 
she was like, oh, well, that's a way it's off. Which doesn't seem right, because this is day 22. Three, we're three weeks into the deal. And about a week into the deal, they said it would be four to six weeks that I had to stay off of it. But anyway, point being, she was like, oh, well, that's a way it's off before you can do that. But I just got the word yesterday uh, that I think I, it's on by Friday, either on Friday or Monday, they're actually going to start letting me get in my wheelchair. And so, yay! So, so I'll be able to, you know, go to the therapy room and take strolls around the hallway and shit like that, but uh, for a very limited amounts of time, for like maybe, I don't know, a half hour at a time or something. I don't really know, but we'll see, we shall see. Um, what else? As you can tell, man, it's uh, I don't know. It's really early in the morning. I didn't sleep that great last night, um, despite all the cool drugs I took. Um, I don't know. Some lady came in to draw blood, and and. Uh, kind of fell asleep while she was doing it, but she turned, like, the bright lights on in my room, and then after she left, it was just, like, all the bright lights were on, and it fooled me, and so I, I, I couldn't fall back to sleep. So, uh, let's see here, what else? Eric, can you come to the front desk, please? Eric, can you come to the front desk? What else? Third or fourth? Not a whole lot. Aunt, my Aunt Kay came by yesterday. And that was kind of cool. She brought me a cup of coffee, um, and uh, it was a freaking party in here yesterday. Uh, my roommate Terry, uh, his whole family came by. Well, not a whole family, but a lot of his family came by. His wife and his in-laws came by, and seemed like nice people. Uh, I had a nice little gathering here in a uh, one twenty room one twenty seven. By the way, we're coming at you from St. Charles Missouri. Beautiful heartland. These good old United States of America. Right at the confluence of the mighty Mississippi and the majestic Missouri Rivers. St. Charles, Missouri. So then one what's on the agenda for today? First, I plan to order breakfast. See if I can get on there right now. I know everyone wants to know, well, shit, Charles. What the hell are you going to have for breakfast? Damn it, I shall tell you. I'll do it right now. Live. Well, live, whatever. Recorded on Land Sonic here. Hello. Oh, the the thing just stopped. The uh, the the alarm was going off on there, and oh, uh, oh there we go. Uh, oh, yeah. I need to order breakfast, please. Uh, one twenty-seven. Yes, one twenty-seven. Yeah. Uh, I would like eggs. Bacon, sausage, bacon, and right. Can I get a, a biscuits and gravy too? Uh, milk. Yeah, that'll be all. Okay, thank you. All right, bye. So, bam, you're on my YouTube clip now.
Oh, yeah? Yeah. Anyway. Okay, I just, yeah. Uh, well, you're not supposed to be filming in the hospital. You're not? Okay, uh, I was just joking, you know, my YouTube story. Okay, I, I didn't know that. Okay, I'm sorry. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and cancel it then. What kind of rule is that? Can you take pictures? No. Oh, you can't, you can't really be oh it's the HIPAA thing. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, alright. Yeah. Alright. So, but is it cool if I just do it, like, myself? And then you can get yourself, but as long as there's no employees or okay, all right, okay, so that's cool. Then. All right, let me go ahead and uh, cancel, cancel this. Then I'm sorry, I, I didn't even you're think about that. You're fine. I'm just letting you know, Gorn. All right. I did no, I. No, no, no. It makes perfect sense, uh, but I didn't even think I because I remember you know the hip. The HIPAA thing, and I didn't even put two and two together. Yeah. Oh, okay. Good. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, I said sorry. No, you're fine. Did uh, you need anything else? No, no, it was just, just the alarm. Just that alarm. Yes. All right, we'll get to the rest. Wow, Boston. Boston. Okay, there. Oh, yeah, so. I forgot there's this uh, privacy thing. Where you're not supposed to be filming in a hospital. I guess I could film myself, but no other people. Because there's some sort of privacy act. I am breaking the law right now. I am a fucking renegade. I better keep it down. People are very touchy about that. They don't like that shit. They don't like that shit at all. Hey, man, my eyes are all droopy. But I don't know, man. So, now I feel like an asshole. I guess I'm gonna go. I really feel like an asshole now, but anyway, hey, that's part of being an edgy goddamn investigative journalist, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here on the inside, reporting on the health care industry. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I guess I could do that. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to do that. So anyway, boy, do I feel like an asshole. Oh, man, so I guess there's nothing really else to report. Everything is boring. I guess I'm going to have to be more careful now about Lamsonicare. Um, damn, I had all these great ideas, too. I'm not allowed to film in here. So anyway, there you go. There's, you know, something, uh, I don't know if that's a law. I mean, or if it's a policy, as they say. And anyway, regardless, who cares? Nothing else to report, so... I guess I was just going to work on my, uh, writing. I've also been, uh, writing all my experiences down. Um, and an article all about my, uh, hospital experience. What it's like to be a GIMP on Medicaid, going through the health care process the healthcare system here in these good old United States of America. Anyway, there's not any more to report, which I 
could have slept better last night. I didn't. I don't know. Hopefully I'll get some sleep today. Uh, anyway, it's day 22. So I got about six more days on these stupid antibiotics. Um, six more days of that shit. Uh, day 22, so that's a little over three weeks. And then, I don't know, I'm thinking hopefully, man, only about three more weeks of this shit all together before I can finally go home. And then Lamasonicare will, uh, my, well, my reporting, you know, this will come to an end. God only knows what uh, the future has in store, but hey, man, I know I'm not supposed to be filming in here, <laughs> but I'm going to keep doing it, and I am going to keep filming, and I am going to catch motherfuckers on camera, so anyway, I'm going to, I'm in the belly of the beast of the healthcare system, ladies and gentlemen, so anyway, so what is what what's the plan for the day? So it's really pretty early. I had my ordered my damn uh, ordered my damn breakfast. Guess I'm just gonna read. So here's the book I'm reading. Uh, I think I brought this up the other day, but uh. Wait a minute. <laughs> so anyway, I wonder what the uh, punishment is for breaking the hip of reading. the book I'm reading right now. What plan I'm reading after I sign up. It's called uh oh, 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 oh. I hate it. Very deep. Very deep. Okay, yeah, anyway. It's about these people who live in domes on Mars. It's all crimes. get off. Not much to report. I think, yeah, I'm getting better. There's so much. Just gotta be patient. It's April 16th, so hopefully, you know, we'll be out of here sometime in May. And, um, so that should be good. Anyway, this is Lansing signing out. Lansing, I don't care. Stay out of trouble, kids. Use protection. <laughs>